Trowel. What do you mean? Trout. Trout. <laughs> Hello. It's been a while since I've had a trout. Thanks for the raid, Dm Dm X. I'm not sure how you would say that, but yeah, thank you much, Lee. I hope your stream was a good one, and I also hope you're hearing this and not stuck with an ad, because I think about that sometimes. People might think I'm an arsehole for not saying thanks, but they didn't hear it because they were in an ad or something at the time. There's too much to consider. Are we actually done? Allow me to explain. Monster, you have to feel. Oh, yeah, we don't need that. Allow me to explain. Oops. And hello, raiders. I appreciate you stopping by. I hope you're all well today. Tell me what happened. I killed things. What a report. Oh, job well done. An old OG fan. If so, I'm glad you're still around, or still remember me after all these years. But the old OG fans know me for my stupid, hyper, annoying commentary. Too much energy. Use this well. And obnoxious commentary. Fool's gloves. Oh, thanks. What an insult. This will this will save me quite a bit of time. You have my gratitude for your efforts. I'm not. Yeah, I am. It was combat. Oh yeah, that, well, that's understandable. Younger people could deal with that commentary more probably, because lol, random. But yeah, I'm glad you enjoyed. I just hope it didn't. I hope it wasn't a bad influence on your younger mind. Please don't tell me you grew up talking about demon butts and stuff. I'll feel guilty. I corrupted someone. Can I have some defense? I guess so. Just give it all to Adol. He's such a doll after all. Could I not get that before? Is this even the right way? Oh, it's one of these again. Wait, this is this place. Oh. Okay. I guess we'll go there now. Oh, I guess it's okay then. You know, if there was anything in the world to get corrupted by, demon butts is probably one of the, probably one of the worst. Actually, never mind. I was going to say not so bad. Oh my, what's that? Oh yummy, that is one beautifully scrumptious piece of Hell Knight pass. Yes it oh, is. Oh. oh god, he's running for you and he's going to sit on you until you stink run while you can. Excuse me. Where you go? Alrighty then. That's pretty mouldy that is. I just wanna hug it, that's all. But yeah, it's good to see ya. Even if you're not an active watcher these days, it's always nice to be remembered. Uh, what was I doing? There was a quest around here or something. Wait, did I do it? Oh, it's up there. Yeah, I I try to stream quite often, but it's been a bit a bit inconsistent lately with the heat and life stuff, but. Troublesome. Oh no, it's Shanty. Well, if it isn't my favourite little darling's working hard, I take it. Yeah. Hi, Shanty. Oh, and you too, Mr. Roscoff. More like coughing. 
forget the word. The word hump. Oh dear, I'm sorry. My channel is not for educating the youth. Except it might lead to a better world where people are more accepting of people who enjoy hellish rears. Oh, this is your first time meeting, isn't it, Adol, my dear? Allow me to introduce you to Mr. Roscoff. He's the owner here at Le Bistro Blanc. Oh, it's a, a competing cafe. We've got a tavern, not a cafe. Never mind, it's fine. Hello there, please. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. He's Chubb. Mr. Roscoff here is a business neighbour of Pendleton's. We often have him cater for us. Are you already familiar with him too, Shanty? Oh, I've known him for quite a while. He and I are fellow culinary artists, after all. We get together for a little advice session every now and then, just like this. An advice session is something the matter, Mr. Roscoff. Well, yes, as it so happens, I was thinking of expanding our menu in the near future. Yeah. If, if in hell, they do things like... I don't know. They probably do things relating to butts, especially if you've seen that game Agony. There are some rather disturbing things going on there. Um, then yeah, I don't know, actually. No. I don't know. I'd rather just stay here, where there's art. You can enjoy the art safely from your computer chair. Whenever you want. Oh yeah, from Game Anyone. That still hasn't come back. I check I check back sometimes just to see what happened. In fact, isn't the website gone now? Like it it stopped working at some point soon after the pandemic started, I think. But I think it's finally gone now. I wonder what happened if like the admins or one of the admins or something caught it and didn't make it or something. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for missing stuff. That's a common occurrence here. Okay, see you later. Thanks again for the raid and for stopping by. Be yeah, always welcome if you want to stop by again. Whenever I do stream, it's usually at like 6 or 7 p.m. GMT, my time. On whatever days I do, but there's no real set schedule. But yeah, have a good and see you latte. I'm glad you enjoyed. I'm glad I could inspire with my nonsense. Missed the video? No, I saw the link to it, but I didn't want to... Oh! Bye. Is that how you say bye when there's four exclamation points? Bye! It's supposed to be BYE! Well, thanks very much, Lee. And see you later. Yeah, he just slipped slipped through your fingers. A slippery fella right there. Namely, by bringing back a local specialty for the previous owner's management. I don't know what they were talking about anymore. I shouldn't stream games with a lot of story and reading. I don't keep track. It's hard enough keeping track of the chat. But then the chat mixes in with the game. Unfortunately, we're having a rather rough time figuring out where to start. I should just do things the way Vinny does it. Just record things off stream and then do a rerun, so I never have to interact with people. No. That's like the reason I stream, is to chat. To do my best to do so anyway. Book stream? As in a stream where I sit here just reading. Well, I did do that one off Geneforge remake demo, that's pretty much a book, with minimal gameplay and graphics. Local specialty? Now that you mention it, I think I remember eating that dish when I was little. I assumed ownership here upon introduction by a local eatery after the war eight years ago. As such, I never had the dish myself, but towns would consider it quite a delicacy. Sadly, however, all but mere fragments of the recipe have been lost to the ravages of war. 
and the previous owner took it. He remained in clues with him when he passed a few years back. Reptiloid, play East 8. It's good. And this makes me want to play it again, because it's it's got more combat and explory. It has probably got more reading than all the other ones you've played so far as well, but it's not like this. As much as I'd like to help, I'm afraid I'm at a loss with this one. Or were you going to try and pish him next? I don't remember. Probably whatever you're in the mood for whenever the East mood strikes again. Definitely the first one I watched. Wait, I'm the first one you watched. Who was? Oh, the first Let's Player. I think my first one... Oh, no, my first one was Cloud8745. I was going to say Halloween. 4545. Four, five. Cloud8745 and then Lewis Prower. I think Cloud is still going as well. He was up and down a lot. If only we knew what ingredients we used, then we might be able to recreate it. Perhaps it would be more constructive to think of a new menu item entirely. Mr. Ruskoff could really use our help. What do you think, Adol? Sure. Yeah, you know, we're only saving the world from, like, the evil dimension of monsters. But yeah, I guess we can do a recipe. Yeah! Yeah! Hmm. Well, aren't you a sweetheart? Yes, apparently. I couldn't ask for anything more. Are you sure it's not any trouble? Well, it is, but, you know, trouble is my middle name. I've got to try the dish myself. Yes. Oh, now I see you trying to get yourself a little local flavour, are you? Wink. I don't get it. I've got enough flavour, thanks. Naturally, I'll be willing to compensate your efforts with a good meal. At the least I could do in return for your assistance. It's a deal then. As for where we can start, there have to be people around here who remember the dish to some extent. Fucking hell. If we find them and ask, we might be able to figure out what the ingredients are. That's not how you find out what ingredients are in something. Hmm, yes. I can taste about 10 grams of butter in this. Uh, definitely two sprinkles of pepper. Or is it three? Oh, now there's an idea. I can say with some certainty that the dish incorporates both seafood and vegetables. Perhaps you'll ask some. You could ask someone with a great deal of knowledge about either. That would make our best bets the main square. Oh, an agricultural district. Right. Even though I can only vaguely recall that dish myself. It does mean there's a chance that Carla remembers it too, more than I do at least. Let's start asking around, Adol. Finally! We've been talking about a bloody dish for ten minutes. Oh. So many original viewers around, it's weird. It's like... The viewers, the people that still show up and stuff, are people who have been around for the whole time, pretty much. And we don't really get that many new viewers, as far as I can tell, who stop in and, like, become a, a big part of it. Maybe it's too, like... I don't know. Maybe it feels like a, a community that already exists and people have trouble fitting in or something. Because that's what I get sometimes online when I try to meet people and it's like all groups that are in their little circles and you don't really know how to get involved. But I guess that's just the way the world works anyway, unfortunately. People find their little niches to slip into. Or whatever. Huh? You have some business with me? I'm always tempted to kind of skip all this stuff, I don't care about a recipe. A fisherman would probably know, right? Um, we were just wondering something. Kickstarter non-starters, wasn't that the... I don't remember his name. The guy who did that... That thing where he... Brings out the tape measure. And does a penis joke. 
measures a small one and says, ooh, ouch, or something, I don't remember his name. Round when streaming on Blip TV? I've never heard of Blip TV. You got the wrong person. I was on Justin TV, and then I moved to Livestream.com or .tv, and then I moved back to Twitch. Because Livestream, I think, didn't do archiving or something, or it didn't send out alerts. Did I get confused? Probably. Wait, what did I do? Did my brain die? What happened? Starter non starters. Recipe. Something awful. Huh? Super Mario Land. No, that was on Justin TV, I think. They're still in the archive here as well. There was Hitbox TV as well, but I don't think I ever used that. Did I just say something? I probably just said something wrong, like a wrong word somewhere. If you ask whether Philippe knows anything about the bistro specialty from years ago. You mean Le Bistro Blanc, right? I know the dish you're asking for. Really? What was it called? I can't exactly recall, but I do remember having it back where I lived in the Noble, dis noble District. It's not down on May 18th. Yeah. It's weird, it was like there, but, but dead for a year and a half. You couldn't upload playlists or anything anymore. Because they smoked, oh no. Yeah. Luckily I didn't get involved in a, a group of people who smoked, but I, there was a danger of it. The only time I've ever smoked, I had one puff of a cigarette because there was a group of cool kids who I, I wanted to seem cool and hang out with them or something, so they let me have a puff of a cigarette, but I didn't like it, luckily. They used to hang out in the corner of a field at break time, so they wouldn't get caught. So they wouldn't get caught. It blew my low expectations of commoner food straight out of the damn water. The juiciest white fish, juicy. The juiciest white stuff, more like. The firmest clams, the tenderest shrimp. That dish had it all. I always loved fish. Now my days are spent reeking of it. Ugh, have a bath? Fate's a cruel one, I tell you. What? What do you mean, fate? Didn't you choose to be a fisherman? Presumably. Sorry to hear that. Still, it's wetting my appetite just hearing about it. Wetting your appetite hearing about that he reeks of fish. A dish with that much seafood in it must have been worth every last bite, damn right. Oh, I've got a fisherman's pie in the freezer as well. And a mariner's pie. Marina's, however you say it. <clears throat> it was especially considering how easy a fresh fish comes by thanks to this canal. Oh, that's not even counting imports. There's a reason Balduke has so many seafood dishes. Our custom of eating fish on the Hieroglyph Faith Day of fasting doesn't hurt either. Oh, this really brings me back. What I wouldn't give to have another taste. Or maybe you will one day. Really was the Baldukian specialty through and through. Could we maybe ask you to tell us more about the specific seafoods used in that dish? Oh, well, let me think. If memory serves, a particular white fish they used was... Oh, good, it faded out. Special seafood. Special seafood food. And someone there as well, apparently, maybe. Smack a computer. I don't know what the, what the worst thing I did in school was, but I have a memory of when I was at a training thing after school. NHS training. Uh, for some, for whatever bloody reason, I decided it would be a good idea to staple a mouse wire. Just put a staple through a mouse wire for some reason. But I didn't expect it to start beeping on the computer like it was doing this constant beep, which set off the staff. And then I blamed it on someone else, and we both ended up having to go to the 
like break room and be talked to, but then I admitted it was me. Life made easy with Pendleton. What a fucking twat I was blaming it on someone else. How may I be of assistance? Grow up. No time. Thank you for shopping with us. But then I wasn't 18 yet, so I was still in my formative years, I guess. I don't know, it was weird. I guess it was like thinking it was trying to do an input or something. I don't know. I don't know how technology works. Oh, it's you. Is something the matter? <clears throat> well, actually, there's something we wanted to ask you, Carla. You ask her if she knows anything about the bistro's long-lost specialty. I see, so you're planning to recreate that dish, then? We hope so, anyway. We were thinking you might remember it better than I can. Well, I was pretty young at the time myself, so I only have the vaguest recollection. But I do remember one thing, the broth. It was warm, soothing like a herbal... an herbal soup. An herbal. Herbal soup, huh? It was the most delicious part, rich with all sorts of simmered spices and fish. More fish. You were so small back then, but you'd always make room to ask for extra helpings of soup. There's poop in my soup! There's a game called that for some reason, I think I have it as well. I don't want that. The mouse crying, yeah, I'm sorry, computers have feelings too after all. That movie was right that I can't remember the name of. But it got a sequel recently with Harrison Ford in it. He was in the movie. I don't remember what it was called, but it was like cyberpunky. I don't think that movie was even about computers having feelings, so never mind. <clears throat> but yeah, I didn't get suspended, but I did have to go home without pay that day. Oh, did I really? It sounds familiar. Yeah, Blade Runner, that was it. Why is it called Blade Runner? They're not running on a blade. Calling it medicinal does sound a little unappetizing, but if even us kids liked it. One sip of that soup could draw in just about anyone's, anyone, no matter what their taste. You know, I think I actually have the recipe written down in my room somewhere. Wait, you do? Oh, you had this awful cold a long time ago, so I asked the owner how to make it. Ah, the memories. He was such a kind old man and wonderful with kids at that. Oh. Oh yeah, I uh, remember that too, definitely. It shouldn't take long to dig up. Do you mind waiting for a bit? <clears throat> Not at all, thanks, Carla. <clears throat> Man, whenever I put, start putting lore and story and dragon dreams, it's not going to be this long, don't worry. Or this, like, unrelated to the plot. Water time. <clears throat> Oof. 2049, was that the second one? Omega lol. The DJ key on the keyboard. Oh dear. I do vaguely remember a keyboard in school that had like inbuilt sounds and stuff. It was a a Yamaha one where you could save it on a floppy disk. In fact, that's where that's where the I guess theme of Virus Bloke One came from. When you're in like my little hut in the first game, the music in there I made on one of those Yamaha keyboards back in secondary school. Lore. the bistro. <clears throat> I've lost it. What's this now? Oh, there's another one I have to go check. BTTV quotes. Hello. Come again. Hello. <laughs> the 
there's a woman posting a flyer on the bulletin board. Why is it called bulletin? There's not a bullet in it. 23 seconds in, is this the moaning sound? Did I say 23? <laughs> this guy's having a laugh. Thank you. Oh, I do remember that sound actually. I don't know if it was on the one I used, but I I recognised that very specific. Come on! Oh! Oh, you guys need something? Oh, I get it. Hey, it's Marley. No, it's Marie. Never mind, I thought we were in Chrono Trigger for a moment. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about Chrono Trigger. I still love it. Just East 9 came along. I'd rather be playing Chrono Trigger, to be honest. Oh! Oh, I get it. Looking at the first look... Looking to get the first look at my new scoop, are you? Here you are, loyal readers. Oh, thanks. It was simple as that. I can go now. Thrusts a flyer at you. Ow. Special issue. Monstrum's to blame for serial thefts. When will they strike the prison next? Hehe, <laughs> those Monstrums really are a gold mine of intrigue, aren't they? God, it's like real life newspapers. Stir in the pot. Or whatever. See, I've made it my mission in life to bring truths like these to the eyes of the people. Keen-eyed individuals. Commander Keen. Like myself, we're a rare breed. Oh, breed. It's up to us to enlighten the masses. Uh, but despite all my hard work, the soldiers and citizens keep brushing it off like gossip. Yeah, it is. It is pretty much like 70% dialogue. That's alright, just hold enter and it'll skip through all of it and then you can get to the good stuff. But yeah, it's been like, I think about 12 hours, <clears throat> 12 hours of gameplay now and we've had like two dungeons. And a bit, a little bit. Unbelievable, right? I mean, huh? I don't know what they've done. What happened to East? Speak of the devil, was always on me with the whole stop post on private property bit. I better duck out while I can. See you next time, loyal readers. Yeah, fuck off. This oh, this must be the flyer. Need to remember to have the gold ready too. Yeah. Hell, I'm even tempted to put this below East Two at the moment. Like legit. Probably still like it more than East One. It's just a troublesome one, like the gameplay is all there and stuff, but if in, if only it was more of the gameplay. Seventy percent visual novel. Hmm. <laughs> that is not a bargain at all. Do I want that? Oh, I got fool's gloves, didn't I? Adds poison, confuse, or petrify to attacks. I want some tarantial thread, please. But you can't get it here. Relinquish fire and gold and raise tabloid? Yeah! The new, yeah, the new Colossus was like the the next one, wasn't it? After Old Blood and after New Order. I think I heard that one had a lot of cutscenes. Yeah, Self Setter was good. Since they turned into the three party or three member party system thingy, they started adding more story and talking as well. 7, Cell Setter, 8, and this one, but this one is the worst offender. By fart. Payment received, I accept your request. So, um, how exactly are you going to get the info? Probably by listening to the garrisons. Horse! Oh, fat. An owl? Got a job for you, Art, uh, Arthur, not Artba. Coo! What a smart bird. Amazing. Never seen an owl before, Adol. 
much smarter than foolish humans to be sure. You worried info on the prison's infrastructure, in other words, its layout and security. Bloody Harry Potter the anime now. Whether I can procure that intel, intel is up to our man on the inside, only time will tell. That's probably Greg, isn't it, who, who let not Adol go? A bit. I reckon. I'm interested in the story at least. I just wish there was less of this boring side stuff. But you don't have to do it, I guess. I'm doing this to myself, my completionism. Here it is, the chance you've been waiting for, a deal too sweet to resist. All you gotta do is take on this job. Clients looking for intel on the prison's layout and patrol routes. This isn't very guardsman-like of you. Heh, <laughs> don't you act all wide-eyed and innocent with me, redhead. I wouldn't even be up here if I believed in any of those bullshit roars of theirs. I don't know much about any sectors I don't oversee, but I wager a master escape artist like you might be able to fill in the blanks. You got nothing but time, eh, redhead? Go for it. We'll make a mint, you and me. Music. You have a feeling that you're getting mixed up in something else here. Still, this may be a prime opportunity to gather intel on the prison. Like, I'm so curious what's going on here with Adol and not Adol here. Like, the game isn't even acknowledging it. It's just behaving as if this is Adol. It's weird. But we'll find out soon enough, I guess. Benjamin Button, who's that? Naughty. Horny Joe, yeah, this must be the real adult then, he's pretty horny. Get him pretty horny, twat. Oh, I don't remember where that quote comes from. Actually, it was the old video camera videos. Yeah. Some gameplay. Look. It's real. That was cool. I want to do it again. I really want to get to whatever the next dungeon might be in this stream, so I might go for a bit longer, I'm not sure. Depends. Oh. Seems to be a list of those previously imprisoned. The name Adol is nowhere to be seen, however. Even though I was. The last entry has been blacked out. Could this one be yours? It's very suspicious, that is. Ah, oh, what a lovely day! I'm going! What's this? Funimation? Toru? What? My Hero Academia Toru? Oh, the Invisible Girl. That, that's a great figure, that is. It's just it sticks. Stairs continue to descend from here. You may be able to find a way out of this tower if you keep heading down. Did we need that little break there? This door appears to have been rusted shut. Doesn't seem like it'll budge. Kick it. There seems to be some sort of mechanism to open the gates. Certainly does. Freedom! Ah! I'm out! Wait, I'm actually going to be playing not adult out in the town now. Which one is the real Santa Claus? Which one? This one! He's the fattest Santa Claus I ever saw. Seems you've exited the tower entirely. You should still have plenty of time to investigate ahead for now. 
<laughs> Why is there a random drawbridge here? Oi! Oh no! Waste high boxes! Hello? Uh. Oh. Rusted considerably. What a puzzle. Ah! Uh, I guess I'd better answer this since since people are out right now. Burr. Oh. Ugh. It was Das Sister Heft. Get rid of the. I did get rid of the burb. Cloaca. HMRC? What's that? Hot. MILFs really close. I don't want them. MILFs ain't my jam. They're my marmalade. No, I like marmalade actually. They're my. What don't I like? I don't know, man. They're my inflation fetish because I don't like that, so. Among the jumble of scrolls is one that looks like a map of some sort. Prison floor plan. Is Adol gonna give the floor plans to Adol? It's a rough floor plan of the prison. Oh, we're in Thief now. Thief 9. Cry for help wishing it was winter. I do wish it was winter. And then when it's winter, I wish it was summer, because whenever it's one extreme or the other, I say, man, I'd rather it be the other one than this. It can't be this bad. But no, it's always worse than I remember, and winter is always the best. No, autumn master race. Autumn or spring, really. I like it when the leaves fall, and the nice relief of cold weather. But I also like spring because flowers are nice and a little bit of warmth so it's comfortable to go out. I don't want your human sized... Human sized dragon dildos? How can that exist? Dragons aren't human sized. <clears throat> Wait, yeah, that's just confusing, that is. Oh shit, I'm not going to tell them where Yoshi is. Then they'll find out what I did with him. My sister's profile on a dating app. I wouldn't be surprised if if one of them was on there. I guess. Does that sound like an insult? It's not supposed to be. It's just one of them's had a lot of boyfriends through the years. This will surely come in handy when making your way around the facility. <clears throat> Firmly shut. Yeah, it is. Open it then. 